2050. Minister of Justice and Constitutional Affairs have for the second time faced the Public Accounts Committee, Central, to discuss recent auditing reports submitted to Parliament. We intend to... During the financial year 2022-2023, the Ministry had a budget of 159.269 billion shillings, which according to the Auditor General's report was fully utilised. However, the committee chaired by Mwanga Chivumbi observed how the ministry had 66 activities to be implemented in the year 2022-2023 and out of these, 31 were implemented and 29 partially implemented, yet the monies were spent. There are those you attempted to implement and you partially implemented. Those had monies allocated to them, okay? There was zero performance, but yet the money was spent. So where did you put the money? Is there any money that was retained that you have that was not spent on these other activities? Because the committee tasked the Permanent Secretary, Minister of Justice and Constitutional Affairs, to explain the allocation of the utilized monies, yet the activities were not implemented. In area, some areas we did over 100% compensating for those areas that with uh, bills that we didn't do, as an example. Park also revised the performance of the Administrator General, Minister of Justice and Constitutional Affairs, where he was allocated 2.28 billion to which the report indicated a 99% performance. However, the committee interested itself in finding more information on the balance of 2.405 billion not being paid to the estate's beneficiaries of the deceased. The different, those that you have taken three, four years mm -hmm. holding these estates and you have failed to identify beneficiaries. Mm -hmm. Management did not specify the amount to which known beneficiaries are entitled and that which cannot be uh, allocated. The Administrator General, Charles Casibayo, interested the committee in management of deceased estates. As uh, saying, uh, uh, this money is for the late so and so, that information is accessed by the auditors. The only information is when people send to money and say beneficiaries, because we also extract that information from the bank statements. The committee requested the officials to specify documents of the costs of all implemented and non-implemented activities to determine the amount in making informed decisions. Lydia Chomkama and Gloria Gutavinji, Parliament.